Hey folks, Andy Headhart Hat Smith here with wife Amy. We're going to go geocaching in hell. Coming up next. Folks, Andy Headhart Hat Smith here with wife Amy. We are in the cool shade right now in this little park. Uh, unfortunately, the one geocache we were looking for at the main headquarters of Hal, Michigan, which is remarkably an ice cream shop, <laughs> uh, we uh, moved on and uh, found another geocache nearby. Uh, because that one was gone. Because that one was gone, so we had to DNF that one. But uh, we, we are looking and actually found another one very close by. And uh, so this is going to be our first geocache in hell. Let's show you what we found. Okay, what do we got here? Here, let me get a... Very interesting. Yes, I was telling wife Amy about the, uh, the voraciousness of the Michigan mosquito. They've got some that are here. There's one flitting by her right now, matter of fact. Uh, there's some here that have uh, a black abdomen with white stripes on them, and they are just so aggressive, and they will eat you up. So I'm glad we're doing the geocaching during the day and not so much uh, towards the nighttime when they really like to come out. So uh, here's the uh, geocache. A little bit of swag, big enough to hold a travel bug, and uh, interesting. Add to this with this. So yeah, it was really kind of fun. Uh, we, we're going to go back to the ice cream shop because they have Hershey's ice cream, which is very popular in Michigan. And uh, have a good time. Enjoy the, uh, the touristy part of, uh, of Michigan with all this. And, and it's a lot of fun. It really is. It's not quite the giant ball of string, but everybody has to go to hell one time or another, just saying. And of course, during the... Um, during the winter months, news crews like to come and take pictures of the roadsides to hell, uh, especially when after an ice storm, because then they can sit there and literally say hell has frozen over. So either that or the Lions are in the finals, I'm just saying, one of the two. But uh, yeah, good stuff. We're going to sign the log here and uh, put some bug spray on and see if we can find another geocache in hell. Okay, as you can see, we are at another scenic spot here near Hell, Michigan, and uh, wife Amy is down by the lake uh, taking some pictures. Uh, I am going to be going for this particular geocache uh, because the one that uh, is here is in kind of a semi, I wouldn't say heavy, but at least a, a good light coating of poison ivy, which wife Amy is very, very allergic to. I am not. So uh, well, let's go see if we can find this geocache. So we got a lot of foliage here and uh, nothing too bad. Michigan, you really don't have to worry too much as far as uh, nastiness when it comes to snakes and stuff. There is the Massasaga rattler, which is a piggly rattler, but that's more up north. Not so much here, though they can be here. Uh, but really, you, you, don't, you don't come into it that much. And uh, I can actually see the geocache from here. Uh, it's right in through here. Looks like it's seen better days. And it is wide open. Somebody left it right there. Okay. They didn't put the log back. I would assume. So there you go. Sometimes you find them this way. There's the geocache. Looks like a Nutella container. Looks actually relatively, relatively dry in here. So I am going to sign the log and uh, put this back, and we'll go see if we can find some more geocaches. Uh, we'll go from there. Very interesting. Very cool. Another geocache from hell. Hey, folks, we're finding our final geocache. The one thing we did notice while we are here in hell is the uh, the GPS. Or not the GPS signal, but the uh, phone signal, the cell phone signal, has been really, really unexpectedly weak. So we've been struggling to find geocaches, a couple good DNFs, and uh, went that way. But we did find our third and final geocache right here in a cemetery. So let's go see if we can find it. I think this one's going to be a little bit height challenging for wife Amy. Just <laughs> saying. I'll follow you. 
Let's go. I found it. Alright. And what is it? Woo! It's a woo! What do we got? Nano! Interesting place. Alright. Here. Thank you. I will hold this in my hand. So we will sign the log, put it back, and probably expect to do the next hour or so checking out the gravestones at this... Uh, very interesting, looks like a family plot cemetery off the road. And then it's time to go uh, visit some family. So, cool stuff. Let's head back to our starting base in hell and wrap things up. So here we are, uh, finishing up our afternoon in hell. And uh, had a really good time today. So you've been in Michigan a whole day. Yeah. So, so what are your impressions so far? I really like the summer. Do you? Mm-hmm. That's awesome. What about it? Uh, there's a breeze. <laughs> yes, there's an actual breeze <laughs> as opposed to North Carolina. Where it's like stagnant all the time. Right. Uh, there's very few breezes in North Carolina. Yes. Um, I don't feel like my skin is melting off. Yes, the it's temps are like in the mid-70s right now. Yep. Very comfortable, very nice. Freaking awesome. Yes. Um, I, yeah, I really like the summer here. Awesome. That's great stuff. And we're in hell. Go figure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I, I figured. The ice cream here is awesome. The ice cream is here. <laughs> yep. Awesome stuff. We, uh, I, I figured, what is the most touristy thing that I can come this up with? This is pretty good. This, this is, is right up this there. This is right up there. <laughs> now, of course, tomorrow, uh, we're going to Frankenmuth, and we're going to do another. up there, too. That's very touristy. <laughs> with a German twist. Just yeah. saying. And uh, so we're going to do another oh. vlog there, but yeah, had a good time. Uh, definitely the mosquitoes are out. Yeah, our two the, already tried to eat. Yes, and, <laughs> and so it's, it, we're having a good time here yeah. geocaching in hell. We hope you enjoy the vlog, and that you come back uh, for other ones. Come to the Head Hard Hat channel and uh, check us out for even more geocaching craziness like here in hell, Michigan. Well, we're going to sign off. Have a great one. Have a safe one, folks. And we'll see you out on the trails. Bye-bye.